Hey everybody. So I'm gonna just do like a quick, like get ready with me. This is how I do my makeup. I might do my hair too, depending on how much time I get. My face looks really red right now because I was just picking at it, which I know I shouldn't do, but I'm guilty. I do that all the time. Um, so I'm gonna just prep it really quick before I put my makeup on. I was picking at a few little like blackheads on the side of my nose. But we're all good now. <clears throat> I'm gonna put some serum on my face. I honestly don't know what this is, but um, it's from Glow Recipe. And uh, it just feels so good when I put it on. It makes my skin feel like tight and like moisturized. It just feels good. I'm gonna put this on. It doesn't really smell like anything. It's supposed to be made from like watermelons. Um, plump, plum, plump. Oh, maybe it's made out of a plum. I thought this was like a watermelon. It says plum, I don't know. Okay, Google it, let me know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I don't have much time either because right now the kids are quiet. So I'm trying to take advantage and do like a quick video. I'm gonna put some vitamin C on my face because we all need vitamin C. And this is also like a must have. Oh, this feels so good, it makes my face It doesn't burn, I'm just trying to make it cool. This is um, from Sephora, it's a Sephora brand. Um, it's just a vitamin C serum. If you don't have this in like your daily regimen, you should definitely get one. Um, we all need vitamin C, like in our bodies and on our face. SPF, moisturizer, I'm using the Cetaphil. Just throw that on. We gotta prime the face, make sure we're moisturized so our makeup isn't flaky and all crusty. You know, looking crazy out here. Let's see, I'm gonna time myself how long I take to do my makeup because I never really keep track. I know that I'm pretty quick. This mark here has been there since like December. <clears throat> and I don't usually like break out too bad until like my time of the month. But, um, oh my God, I got like the biggest pimple here in December, right after the holidays. And it literally lasted like up until the day before my birthday, which is in January. January 10th is my birthday. Oh my God, it was like a crater. And I wasn't trying to touch it because I did not want it to leave a scar. And that bitch fucking... Sorry, we might have to edit that part out. Um, but she left the mark, so whatever. <clears throat> so right now I'm going to go ahead and put some primer on my face and I'm using Smashbox Oil and Shine Control. I usually only put this on like the areas that get shiny. Um, like those are my target areas, my cheekbones, my nose, and my forehead, my chin, and then I just spread it out from there. Kind of just pat it. And then we're gonna let that set. And just let that dry. So you see my, my redness kind of went away from what I was doing before. My face is naturally just like red, usually. I just get like, I don't know, I have a lot of blood in my face. <laughs> I don't know why. I'm not a scientist, don't listen to me. Um, I'm gonna just put on some lip butter while I do my makeup. This is from Truly. It's Luscious Lip Butter. And um, this is supposed to like make your lips plump and luscious. I've only been using it for like a week now. It contains a peppermint. So I think that's the ingredient. It's supposed to like burn your lips a little to make them like that. Um, like, so yeah, we'll see if that works. Now I'll have like the video proof to see if it works or not. Okay. Just is from uh, Huda, I love Huda. Um, the color is Macaroon. I don't even know if this is my color anymore, but this thing is like $40 and I'm not gonna be buying new ones just because I got a little bit of sun. So we're gonna make this work, just like we do every day. Um, so this is like a brush on, uh, it's called Faux Filter Skin Finish. And it's just like a brush on foundation. It's very light, but it is buildable. So you could put as much as you want if you want like more coverage. But um, it goes on very light to begin with. Yeah, you see, not my color. 
but we don't care, right? A W. What does the W stand for? <laughs> Alright, so let me just even that out. Throw some here. And guys, don't judge me. This is something to my makeup every day. Um do not you could leave your comments like, oh you know, same here. Or you could not. You could probably just be like, girl, what are you doing? I'm not a professional. So, this is how I make it work. Cover up all those blemishes. My face is actually really, like, more red today than usual. Um, just like I said, right before this, I was picking at it. And then from here, I'll go in and I will just touch up on the areas that need a little bit more I'm thinking about seeing a dermatologist um but i just have like no time between like the kids and their doctor's appointments and their dentist appointments and it's like we as as a mom we always put ourselves like on the back burner but i honestly i have to go to the dentist i have to go to my um my my g my obgyn for my yearly and I have to start getting mammograms this year. I'm so terrified about that. Has anybody gotten a mammogram? I am terrified. If you don't know what a mammogram is, when you're like 35, you have to start getting them. And you literally have to like put your boob, it's like to check for breast cancer. You have to put your boob on a plate, like a metal plate, and they literally squish your boob down and take like pictures to make sure that there isn't any like lumps or like hidden cancers but it hurts <laughs> i've been dreading this moment since i was like in my 20s <laughs> and we're here now so <laughs> and this is not my glam makeup so don't judge me okay this is just like i'm going to target i maybe i'm doing a little bit more because i'm filming it but when i go like full glam it's definitely a little different All right, so i'm gonna put some concealer Years ago, I used to put concealer like in a triangle shape, but now the trend is you only need it on the inner corner of your eye and on the outer corner to like give you a lift. Um, I feel like I still need a triangle because I have three kids, girl, and it gets crazy around here. And I can't be looking like I haven't had any sleep. Even though that's how it normally is. <laughs> okay. Oh, who's that girl? She looks awake now. So then I usually go in with um, the same thing, same stick, but a little bit darker. Um, this is the color Mocha. I'm going to just put this right here on the, um, like right under my cheekbone. Kind of just give me like a contouring look, but not so much. <clears throat> Like just dabbing it because I don't want to ruin the makeup under it. Not nah, look what you did, Angela. You freaking. That's why it's called beating your face. This I could use with the bottom. And the fatter part. And this brush is also from Huda's line, it's a dual ended brush. One is for foundation, the other side is for like contouring. Um, this was like, I think like $30, 30 something dollars, but um, it's so worth it. It's so easy to clean too. My lip butter. So it still goes in my eyebrows. And trust me, normally I'm a lot quicker. I guess they take my time. This is also from Huda. It's called uh, Bomb Brows. Um, and this is like the thinnest eyebrow pencil ever. And what I do, I just like to create natural strokes here. Just to fill in where I don't have hair. Um, so I'm 35. When I was younger, the trend was to have like super thin eyebrows. And I overplucked a lot of the time. 
which then led to the hair not ever growing back. Um, so now the trend is obviously having full, thick, bushy eyebrows, which I don't have. Um, so this is what we do when we don't have eyebrows. I'll just brush these up a little bit. You see how cool that makes it look? It looks so natural, guys. It looks like I never plucked the hair in my life. Fill all that in. I'm trying to let them grow a little bit. That's why you see like the little extra hairs there. Um, who cares? Who cares? Target. All right, we're gonna do this side now. This is the side I always mess up. So don't. Oh, you see? Don't talk to me. Don't. You freaking kidding me? Guys are making me nervous. Okay. Oh my god. So I'm not looking at a mirror. I'm looking at my camera. <laughs> That's why. Give me a second. One thing you gotta get right. It's this section right here. My daughter's watching Minions. She loves that show. She's not like fully talking yet, my little one. She's a year and a half. She's gonna be two in June. So I think she understands what those little minions are saying because she's always like so intrigued. Every time they start talking, she's like, oh my God, they talk like me. I'm just filling these in a little bit. It looks good, right? Right? Right, it looks good. Okay. This is my favorite palette. It was a gift. Um, let me just brighten up my eyes a little bit right here. Just a little bit. This actually looks much brighter on camera than it does in person. It could be because of this. Because of this huge ring light that I'm shining on my face. So I'm gonna just take the same stick that I was using before and dab it a little bit with my eyebrow my eyeshadow brush and just make like a little contouring. Just to give me like a natural. I don't want any like crazy colors. Just want like a natural crease. And this color is mocha. Um, so Allie did my makeup and then Jasmine was doing her own makeup. And Jasmine was going in on all my makeup while I had my back turned. She kind of made a big mess, but it's all good. Nothing that a little brush bath won't fix. I feel like this is so important to have like some sort of definition in your eyes, especially me because my eyes are so small and I don't have too much of a lid. Um, just brush it off here. Just go like in an up angle. Um, <clears throat> a little bit in the middle here, just to give you like a Semi contour, bring it down. Uh -oh. Yes. Mommy. Yeah. Open the door. Hold on, Mom. I'm getting dressed. Oh, you put the red juices in the fridge. Yeah. For you. Thank you, mommy. Yeah. Thank you. No, we're not going to be late. We still have time. No, it's not nighttime yet. We still have time. An attempted break in.
and again i just like to brush it i feel like you waste more foundation when you like drawing your face i do that for the beginning um but to like go in after and just touch up those areas i just like to brush it kind of like a compact mirror mm -hmm. all right now we're gonna just throw on some blush mascara and then we're done this is my favorite palette my uh it's by iconic oh you see so let's make noise now kids are starting to cry gotta hurry up izzy's watching them so they're good for now it's just valentina crying so i'm gonna just take the darker one this one i normally use this one and just go over where i did my little contour just give me like a bronzy healthy glow And we're going to take the pink. Okay. All right. This is also Huda. I'm not obsessed. I'm not obsessed. <laughs> I'm not obsessed. I really like this because it's too um size one is for volume and then the other is for length and curl <clears throat> so i usually do the volume side first focus in on them here so this is just the volume end they actually get super super long I love this mascara. I've literally tried every mascara out there. So <clears throat> that's the volume side. Now we're going to go on with the length and curl. And we're going to just drag up from the base to the end. That's like a huge difference for me. Um, I'm going to take the same lash and curl end, not the volume end. I'm going to just do the bottom. I'm going to look at this mirror, though, because I can't, can't do this. <clears throat> All right. So I'm going to do the same thing with the other side. Uh-oh. Baby is close. I've been kind of sick, actually. And it's not the C word. I just had a cold. It's the other C word. I get a cold like a stuffy nose or a cough like it's february it's still cold out like things like that happen it's not always the c word we're just gonna do lips now this is my favorite lip color i actually got this on sale back in december at sephora it's by anastasia beverly hills um, but the color is called sweet pea so pretty and it goes on so nicely so i kind of do things backwards i put my lipstick on first and then i line them out i i don't know i'm weird like that so i'm just gonna throw this on look at how pretty that is oh i just love it okay People have asked me before, have you gotten your lips done? I'm like, no, I've never done anything to my face. I am so terrified of needles. Like, I'm the type that if I go and get blood drawn, I literally pass out. Like, I will, if I don't pass out, I throw up right after. I get so crazy when it comes to needles. So, I mean, have I wanted to get work done on my face? Yeah, there are some things that I would like to do. But I just can't, I can't like work up the nerves to actually do it. I'm so terrified of getting anything done. I'm just scared because I know it's going to hurt. And I know it's just the, the idea of a needle. It just makes my knees weak. Even like when my kids have like those little play sets, like the doctor play sets. And it has like a little fake needle. And they come and try to like give me a shot. I scream because 
I don't like needles. This lip liner doesn't match, but who cares? Who cares? I am not going on America's Next Top Model. I should get a new lip liner at Target. They have Ulta now. Okay, I'm only going for shampoo and conditioner. I'm only going for shampoo and conditioner. Oh, sorry. I just, I get CNN alerts. And with everything going on today, I always like take a moment and I read them because things are getting crazy out there, guys. It's getting crazy. And I'm here doing a makeup video. <laughs> going to Target. All right, just, this took longer than I expected. This is not how long I normally take. And I have, I have boogers. And I went ahead and I wiped off the makeup because I am, I am so smart like that. I do have some more time. The baby's not screaming her head off yet. So I think I'm gonna just add a little bit of eyeliner. Cause I mean, I would be done. But because I have a little bit more time, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. My neck matches, right? I think so. It's just like an eyebrow setter. Um, I always forget to put this on, but like, this does like wonders for my brows. It really stays on. I'm gonna just throw that. And I hope you guys could see the difference from like how we started to how we finished. Um, yeah, this is huge difference, I know, but we just went crazy, you guys, you guys bring out the best in me, I need to buy more eyeliner, we're just going for shampoo and conditioner, I need to like write down what I need, so because when I, as soon as I walk in the door, I completely, my mind goes blank, I'm like, what did I need? Oh, look at those flowers. Oh, look at those vitamins. Oh, look at Ulta. <laughs> like all the lights. I don't know if they do it on purpose. I think I'll mess it up if I do it on camera. But I just always line the outside. I never go in. Especially if I'm gonna just be running around. I don't do a full eye. I just do the outer um, edge, just to kind of like wing it out and make it look a little bit more elongated. Ooh, elongated. Angela, you and your big words. Let me fix that. Now we're done, I think. Wow, look at that. Hmm. Let me get a Q-tip. Don't judge me. I use my own spit. Wow, look at that. That's just, that's just freaking great. Okay, better. And we are ready. <laughs> now I have to get dressed. Now I have to get dressed. Oh, I got these alligator clips on Shein. They were $2 for a pack of six. These are so expensive, but I'm telling you Shein has like all the stuff that we pay so much money for. You can get it on Shein for like pennies compared to what they go for. Um. Am I going to do my hair today? Probably not, because it's a greasy mess. Probably going to just tie it up. I don't know what I'm doing, guys. You make me so nervous. <laughs> We're going to just do this. Besides, I didn't do all this makeup to cover it with hair. Oh, I have to blow my nose. This is not how I'm going to leave it. It's just for now. Okay. I guess that's the end of my video. I just touched it up with some makeup. That is the end of my video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, my get ready with me. I would show you what I'm gonna wear. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll come back and show you what I'm gonna wear. Maybe not. Maybe I'll save that for another day. We'll get ready together. Um, <clears throat> but for now, thanks for putting up with that. And uh, if you have any suggestions or any comments, Add it below. <clears throat> I'll look through them. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out. I'm going to Target.